Lately, everything's changed. We seem closer, like you care more. So here we are with Tony Hadley. You're going to be with us at with Music yeah. Festival, Saturday, 15th of June. Um, what, you played this kind of gig before, you do these festivals. What's so great about doing these these kind of events? Well, what do you love about them? I think, for, I mean, doing festivals for me, I mean, you know, here we are at the beautiful De Moffat Hall in Leicester at the moment, and so I'm doing a short theatre tour, but, but doing festivals, people go... They're not going to necessarily listen to the, all the new album stuff and everything else. They're going for a good time. They're going to rock out, and it's a real. And also, I think what's really lovely about the festival is it's very family orientated as well, in a lot of cases. And they go just to have a good time. So you walk out on stage, and whether it's five, ten, fifteen, twenty thousand people, they're all going. And it doesn't matter what kind of they just want to hear great music. Anyone who's not seen you live in recent times, it tells a bit about your band and who you play with. You've got your own wow. Tony Hadley band, don't you? Well, I call them the Fabulous TH band. Uh, we've been together for years. I think. I think what people don't, well, some people don't remember, is that the, the Spandau originally split up in 1990, which um, was nothing to do with me, by the way. I didn't split the band up first time or second time <laughs> actually. Um, so I found myself as a solo artist, and that's pretty scary in itself. And so what I decided to do is surround myself with great musicians, and um, and I've got to say that the, the boys, you know, are and girls, Lily as well, are all fantastic musicians. They are absolutely amazing, and um, and we're good friends as well. A lot of us got young kids, so so we kind of we all know each other very very well, and we've been together a long long time. Despite my sort of reunions with Spano on a couple of occasions, um, yeah, I've been a solo artist now for longer than I was ever in Spano for. So we're going to go on stage, and uh, from the beginning to the end, it's going to sound great. How long are we on stage for? You're on stage for an hour. Oh, great. So I was just going to say, what? We'll do longer. We can do longer like, if you like. We just like the play to be with. Yeah. Because sometimes on the festivals, it's great when you do the festival, because all your mates are there as well, like your old pals and stuff. And, um, and sometimes you only do like 40 minutes, 45 minutes. And I'm like... <laughs> I mean, more. through the barricade to seven minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, we can't not mention the Spandau songs. What I think what the fans would like to know is, do those songs still mean the same to you as they did back then? Because you're just as yeah. big a part of those songs as the guys yeah. were. I think the first thing to, to answer is, can I sing those songs? Yes, I can, and yes, I will. So things like True Girl, Through the Barricades, you know, I'm the original singer. I sang on those songs when they were recorded back in the 80s and stuff. And, um, and I still get a kick out of singing them. I mean, people say to me, you know, how many times you sang True? A lot, yeah. you know, it's gold through the back. Only when you leave, highly strong, whatever. I've sung those songs an awful lot, but every time you sing them is a different time. So every time you sing them, you get a different reaction off the audience. You know, maybe when you do true, for instance, you get like people just go, "Oh, I love you," <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> a bit of a snog, you know, and stuff like. That. And then, you know, stuff like Gold has become the football song. So, I mean, a lot of that I don't even have to sing, to be honest. Gives me a break, you know. So, come on, you. Oh. But, um, yeah, so, so you know, I like when I'm doing a show, obviously I want to do some of the new stuff as well. You know, like I say, along with True Gold, Through the Barricades, Story, Honey Strung, whatever. We'll be doing some of the new stuff as well. There'll be no getting you off by this, has it? If you, if you want to well, carry on, well, you, no, you carry on into the night. That's well, we fine. do like to play a lot. That's the thing. I mean, I enjoy playing. I mean, I meet some artists and they're like, you know, oh, what, we don't have to do so much tonight. Great. And I'm like, no, I, I want to do more. I want to, you know, once I'm singing and stuff and performing, the band's rocking, we, we, we're quite happy to go on for a while. Not quite as Bruce Springsteen, but uh, we love, three hours. We love the fact that you come on with a cheeky little drink as well, so you're in the same party atmosphere as everybody else. Yeah, well, that's you know, that's you, what we like. Yeah, yeah, you have to, didn't you? I'm, no, I'm, I'm still, still a rocker. <laughs> well, Tony, thanks for doing the interview. Um, we will see you yeah, with, thank you. Yeah, with yeah, music see you next year. Saturday, 15th of June. Be it'd there be, with uh, us. It'd be great. It'd be really good fun. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Tonight